Tonight, six minors are being named persons of interest by the FBI for threats against more than a dozen historically black colleges and universities across the country. And although no explosives have been found at any of the campuses to date, schools across the country have been on high alert, not taking any chances. Students at Clinton College in Rock Hill were told to shelter in place and move to virtual learning today, but there was no direct threat to the school. WCNC Charlotte's Lana Harris reports local leaders believe the timing of the threats to HBCUs are no coincidence. On what would typically be a busy school day, the Clinton College campus is nearly deserted. Out of abundance of caution, we, we moved ahead with a uh, sort of shelter in place on campus. Clinton College President Dr. Lester McCorn says he felt students needed the protection after over a dozen HBCUs were targeted with bomb threats over the past two days. We know the history of this country and we know that uh, domestic terrorism against African American institutions and families and communities is real. I think we're perfect targets for someone's um, you know, crazy notions of superiority. While no North or South Carolina school was targeted, McCorn says that no student should have to deal with something like this and believes that the threats coming this week wasn't a coincidence. Whoever is doing it, I think, is very deliberate about the timing of it. Black History Month. The sentiment was echoed by Charlotte NAACP President Corin Mack. I mean, it's bad enough that we get uh, the shortest month of the year for Black History, right? But the fact that somebody would think that a time where Black people have an opportunity to elevate our history and talk about who we are as a people is the very time that they decide that they're going to um, threaten. Mack says the students didn't deserve this. Our students are already having some levels of anxieties because of the pandemic, and now this is a second layer, right, of trauma. McCorn says African-American institutions have pressed on through racially motivated attacks throughout history, and this will be no different. This is showing the character of HBCUs, which is diligence, vigilance, and resilience. Uh, we only get stronger from these kind of things. Lana Harris, WCNC Charlotte. Clinton College says their safety commit committee met this afternoon regarding the shelter in place and are hoping to lift it within the next 24 hours.